There we are in textured mode. No, that disappeared when you turned it around. That was cool. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, when you UV map something, it it pretty much just has one facing side, doesn't it? Right. That, and uh, it disappears from the back side. So yes, you definitely have to be careful, as you can see. Um, yeah, the inside. You that, see <laughs> yeah. Your gun. Yeah. Uh, one way to fix that is you can select the gun. Go into edit mode on it, okay? And right. I'm just gonna give it just simple unwrap. We're not going to. Yeah. Go into texture face and say two sided. Okay. And copy to all the faces. So we exit. Oh wow, that's okay. something new. I didn't know that. Okay. Well, we have something to wrap on yes, that. We do. Um. So. so gonna open. Um, uh, bamboo. Actually, is, yeah. All right. So, so going to do for this. Yeah, and I got this. Uh, I made this texture, um, and and I had decided that I was just going to use a cylindrical texture mapping on this, so it would wrap around. It's like it wraps around a soup can, like a label would wrap around a soup can. It would wrap right. around this um, bamboo cannon because it basically is a tall cylinder. Right. So U for um, unwrap and then uh, cylinder from view. Yeah. Just going to scale this up. Yeah, and if you scale it a little higher, um, that'll be all right. Um, it, I just kind of dirtied the ends. Um, just to, the texture in that viewport. It's actually repeating, and you can actually show the repeat in it. Have you ever done that? No, I haven't. In the view command, um, I believe it's in there. Uh, maybe in image properties. No, there's a. Is there a repeat button? Um, totally going uh, in a crazy place here. All right, let's close that. Repeat image, view okay. properties, repeat image. And there, that'll show how that image is repeating. Okay. So if you exceed the bounds of your box there, um, you'll see what it's going to hit on the repeat. Okay. So yeah, I knew it was either the view properties or the image properties. <laughs> I obviously don't do it enough lately to uh, have that locked down. All right, so let's go to the camera, press P. And there's our coconut gun. Yeah. All right. So um, another thing we can do for the background mm -hmm. is we can select the background plane and go in here and hit shadeless. So the okay. lighting will not apply. So, so shadeless, it doesn't. Um, it's not affected by the the highlights, the lighting, and all right. that. Okay. So there we have the. But I can see we do have some shading. Uh, on our cannon, it looks like. Yes, we do. Okay, and uh, and right now we have a lot of uh, sort of brightness on the faces of our monkey heads. Okay. Well, I will tell you that we've got the coconuts to do yet. I have not made any kind of a texture for the monkey head, so we'll just have to do something else with them. Okay. Um, 